Have you ever tried to be normal while always knowing you were different? Me too. Hello, all of my fellow misfits. Um, okay, so today I have something for you. And I want to share a tool with you that that is really about getting you to more allowance with everything, where everything becomes an interesting point of view and nothing has to stick you anymore. And when you get to this, like when you're willing to live from a space of everything is what it is based on what it chooses to be, and you don't have to have a fixed point of view about the, about what that is, then you allow yourself to receive from everything, but also when you have it for you and you don't have these fixed points of view about what you are or who you are or where you're stuck, then you allow yourself to change anything. Wouldn't that be a whole lot easier than going, why can't I seem to get out of this? So let me give, let me give an example. One of the things I've been um, I've been looking at myself a lot lately, plus also facilitating a lot and talking to people about is stuff with money. <gasps> money, yes, money. Um, so how many points of view do you have with money? Like how many of those things come up even when I say the word money, money, money? Interesting point of view, I have that point of view. Interesting point of view, I have that point of view. Interesting point of view, I have that point of view. So if you look at it like, like I said, the points of view that come up when you go to, when you think about money, you know, it's hard to earn, I don't have enough, I'm stressed about it all the time, what if it goes away, um, all of that stuff that comes up. Now, notice when you have that as your fixed point of view, when you have that as a point of view, a decision, a judgment, a conclusion, that stuck thing in place, that nothing else can come into existence. Only that which proves that your point of, point of view is right, true, and correct, and what is for you, you allow into your world. Well, what if it was never yours to begin with? How many of those points of view, let's say when it comes to money, for example, how many of those points of view did you buy off somebody else? Everything that is times a godzillion and everything that you've done to make all of those points of view, all the decisions, the judgments, the conclusions and the computations real and true for you and what you must live by will you destroy and uncreate it. Right and wrong, good and bad, pot and pock, all nine, shorts, boys, povads and beyonds. So in this, it's about really giving you the freedom to... Um, function more from question because see that's the other thing is when you have something fixed like this in place let's say with money for example when you're going you know what i'm stuck in this i'm not getting out of it i'm broke i'm poor i'm in all of it um how often do you go to question when you're in that not very often right because question is not what's going to validate where you've made that real and true so in this, this is going to give you the space where rather than go to this is what is, you know what? Interesting point of view, I have that point of view. Interesting point of view, I have that point of view. Interesting point of view, I have that point of view. Now, what is this actually? Oh, you know what? It's actually a point of view that I bought off my mother or my father. Oh, what do I do with it? Can I change it? And then if so, how do I change it? What could I be today that would allow me to create and receive more money in my life right away? Notice that energy went instantaneously when you go to that question is, holy shit, I'm actually asking the universe to contribute to me now. Whereas before I was looking from one point, which is this point of view that didn't allow me to receive anything different. Everything that is times a godzillion where you destroy and uncreate it. Right and wrong, good and bad, pot and pock, all nine, shorts, boys, povads and beyonds. Now, I want to give you another way of using this tool. And it's simple. It's simple. But allowance truly is one of the greatest keys to the kingdom of possibilities. Okay. It truly is one of the greatest keys to receiving and creating the life that you truly desire to create. And I do get it. It sounds simple. And it is. But it takes presence to be 
um, in each moment and notice when those points of view come up because notice the other thing with points of view you'll be going along having a good day and you're like you know what I'm kind of like feeling creative and I've got you know I've got my mojo going on and all this is happening and and then all of a sudden you get this this just this tiny little speck of something which is like you can't do this or you won't succeed or nobody's gonna like it and blah 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 all you know all that crazy shit that comes into your head that kind of stops you all the time well what if you were that present with this that you went oh there's that energy there's that point of view that I have about myself you know what interesting point of view I have that point of view interesting point of view I have that point of view interesting point of view I have that point of view you know what I'm going to choose to go beyond that what question can I be with this that will allow me to create something greater everything that is you all know what I'm talking about with that one, right? You know, when you're having that good day and then all of a sudden you get that like tiny little awareness of some pile of shit that you've been living with forever. And then within an hour to within 10 seconds to an hour to a day, it steamrolled you. And now you're wondering why you're covered in shit. Yeah, that. So everything that is, everything that you've done to make that more real than your capacity to choose beyond it, will you destroy and uncreate all that? Times a godzillion, right and wrong, good and bad, pod and pock, all nine, shorts, boys, povads and beyonds. Now, another way I want to, um, another way you can use this tool is when it comes to people, okay? Having allowance for people, having allowance for everyone in your life and everyone on this planet to be who they're going to be in any moment as they choose to be it. Wouldn't that make life so much easier also? So when you're having, um, you know, an upset or something with somebody interest, so, you know, you've got that, get that energy of somebody in your life that you're just like, Egh. you know, you don't have allowance for them because you have a judgment. You have that charge there. You have something going on where it doesn't, it doesn't allow for anything to be different. So now get that sense. Now, interesting point of view. I'm, I'm being you right now. Okay. <laughs> interesting point of view I have that point of view which is what you're gonna say interesting point of view they have that point of view interesting point of view I have the point of view they have that point of view okay and um, so wouldn't that just be so much more joyful to live by so all of the points of view that you have about money right now Interesting point of view, I have that point of view. Interesting point of view, I have that point of view. Interesting point of view, I have that point of view. Uh, I hope this contributes to you getting more allowance for you, for everybody else in your life, and for all of the points of view that you have running your life in the background. Because that's what they all do. You're like, why can I not have more success in this area? Well, the only reason you can't have more success in that area is because you have some fixed point of view in place, some point from which you are creating. So whew, what would it be like if you didn't have to live from that anymore? So there you go. I hope that contributes. Um, thank you for being here. Thank you for being on this video ride of awesomeness with me. Um, I'll see you all next time. Thank you. Bye. Thank you.